because I'm pretty sure I can handle a nine on this. Crap. I thought I hit that game, but okay, fine. I'll take the miss. Crap. That was really bad. One tip you can give each color. I think I figured out the red. I figured out the blue. Yellow is a quarter. Oh shit! That's even more annoying. Oh no. But yeah, I'm pretty sure Bagel Master is trolling on that one. This is uh, even before FNF even was conceptualized. This is the older game by it. definitely a golf course and a half. I do mean a golf course and a half. Like, I'm trying to remember all the history. Like, I, I researched this specifically so I'd be able to talk about it more easily. Better. Ah. Good. Bop. Bop. Bop, bop, bop. Good. Good. That got flaily. I flailed a little too hard there. Consistently, around that 60 to 70% mark is just where I die. Okay, select, go into the settings, and I disable the auto failure. Because you are right on that. It's it's better to it's easier to learn a song if the fail state is turned off. That way you could see more of it, that way you can anticipate more of it, that way you can practice more of it. And more consistently. Enter twice when exiting the obby. What? Okay. Song options. Ah, I see. That's actually really useful.
That's actually really useful. To be honest, I'd rather have the fail state be at the end of the song. Specifically... So I can understand what I'm doing wrong. Okay. And unnoticed, Bagel Master. I did catch your message, just unnoticed. Holy shit, seriously? What happened? Was absolutely terrible. Okay, I don't think I'm starting to I'm starting to believe that I can't I can't handle a nine on this on this song. I'm starting to think I can't handle a nine on this song. Whoa. Bullshit! That was not a D performance. Did you see the end of that? Moving on. Moving on? I'll take the D minus. Just... Ugh. My organic chemistry score, in a nutshell. But yeah, I really hope you're doing okay, Bagel Master, because, uh... Eep. It's never fun getting into a situation where you are about to suffer something like Yeah, that could be the case, honestly. Because that was... Uh, that was a really dense pattern. Well, specifically more toward the end than anywhere else in the song. Such so it makes sense. Scaling difficulty, but that is some variance. Is a green note. Crap. Holy crap.
Okay, that dense moment? Holy crap, that ruined me. Just the moment we got into that dense section. You can actually see it on the graph here, even. The moment we got into that dense section. I'm like, oh shit, panic, hard panic, super panic. Ah! That was terrible. <laughs> Now I'm really glad I turned off Failure State to the end of the song. <laughs> Potentially? I don't know. I'll give, it a I'll give it another attempt as is, then see if that would change things behaviorally. I was holding. I was holding the right buttons. This is bad. <sighs> Let's give it a shot. What's the worst that can happen? The holding slips off to- Really? Really? What the hell? That's a rude mechanic. No tip called roll. Text on the bottom explains what a row is. What a row is. Okay. Okay, so. Uh. I hit enter twice, game, and it didn't register the enter twice. Oh god. So I guess we're trying this again! <laughs> I mean, it could stop. Just rerun it. Okay, so has to be in the song options. Just on logic. Playback speed of the song as a whole, no. That would be helpful, but same price. Oh, it's a player option! Oops. So in that case, where is it? Sound effect. Change dynamically based on player performance. City perspective. So where is it in here? Ah, scroll speed modifier. So that's probably it. I thought it was like a modifier for the entire speed of the song, not just the at the rate at which notes appear. Or is it? Because if it's modifying the, the entire speed of the song, then that's drastic, and then that's a drastic change in difficulty.
Okay, so then speed mod is the right thing. Okay, so what if I were to set it to... How much would it change if I set it to 0.75? just to gauge differences. That's tricky. Okay, then. So in that case, I'll probably want to, like, hasten that for the slower songs. Noted. That's a really useful feature. Holy shit. Let's give this one more shot with a faster rate. Let's try 1.25. See how much that changes. Good. Noted. Yeah, agreed on that. I'm not. I'm. I have a few things that go into my head on that one, but I'm just not going to mention anything specifically to avoid coloring the picture. Daniel knows that already, but on record, I prefer to actually 
hear a person's way of thinking before I make a judgment. I'm peculiar. Okay, so how much is this gonna whip me on a level? I see that one spike and I am intimidated. Oh no. Set that back down just to just to see what it's like on the base, then make a judgment from there. The artwork looks cute. Giving me uh night in the woods vibes. Maybe that's just me. Specifically that's because of the lack of a borderline on characters. Uh, no. What are those? Oh, wait, those are mines, so don't touch them. That was bad. Mixed up up and down. Holy crap. Huh. <sighs> Not bad. But there were at least a couple different areas where I just hard blocked. Oh, it, there's still more. Actually, looking at the uh, bar under the name of the song, we've still got maybe half this thing left. Never mind. That sounds like an end. <sighs> I'll take it. I'll take it. How did I manage to last through the dense shit?
Like, uh, uh, <laughs> that one stupidly dense part of the song. What? <laughs> that is barely front loaded. Excuse me? What is with the jump on this one? And it's like, okay, stupid easy. Two. Next easiest difficulty. Four. Next easiest difficulty. Ten. Sure, just skip ten- uh, just skip six different paradigms of difficulty. Let's get whipped. That sounds accurate. That sounds accurate. This sounds vaguely familiar. Actually, come to think of it, I think Daniel showed me this at some point. If not, it was... Yeah, I think actually he did show me this song. Give me a few moments, I'll read that off once I have a gap. Stupid panic. Ah, melted hard. Follow Big C. Welcome to Synapse. We host all types of wanderers here, yourself included. <laughs> the TLDR of who I am. I play random shit. I'm not afraid of failure. I'm not afraid of learning, and I'm highly adaptive. FP Fest. Uh, no idea what that is. A little more information, please? Huh. There are only two difficulties. Do you want to die, or do you want to die faster? <laughs> Fanfest of fans of the FP movie series and DDR. Oh, that's nice. I hope you enjoy that. Like, legitimately, it's always nice going to those types of things.
The artist wanted to do the steps themselves, only managed to finish two different- Oh god. Oh good!